<laughs> we're here joined by Montel, Montavious Porter. And like Tropicana, he's got the juice. Look at the, look at that suit. That's a great suit. I love it. How are you doing? I'm doing exceptionally well. I'm, I'm doing much better than you are. Actually, I mean, I'm in the presence of greatness, so I, I am doing pretty well. Yeah, you, you're doing okay. But yeah. As soon as I leave, you're going to go back down to being mediocre. So. That's true. Uh, can you talk to your life? You know? That's true. You're used to it. <laughs> can you uh, just talk about the big match that your client has, Omos? against Brock Lesnar and kind of what you guys have done to scout and get ready for that match? Yeah, this is the absolute biggest match of the Nigerian Giants career. And it is literally the biggest match in WrestleMania history. The Nigerian Giant has about four years in professional wrestling. Now. He's only 30 years old. So his upside, his potential is immeasurable. He understands the task that is ahead of him. But I was explaining to people that Brock Lesnar has everything to lose. Omos has nothing to lose. The pressure's on Brock Lesnar. Yeah. If Omos should lose, he comes away better. He comes away with the experience of facing one of the most dominant and iconic WWE superstars of all time on the WrestleMania stage. And if Omos wins, then he gets to say that I am the biggest baddest man in the WWE, and that shit put him well on his way towards capturing WWE gold. Could Brock Lesnar F5 no, your client? No. No, he can't. Brock Lesnar cannot F5 the Nigerian Giant. I don't think that Brock Lesnar can even suplex the Nigerian Giant. Wow. I don't think it can happen. Wow. And two things that we've seen Brock Lesnar do with Omos twice is hesitate and back up. We've never seen Brock Lesnar mm -hmm. move in reverse, except when it comes to standing in front of Omos. Twice, Omos made Brock Lesnar retreat. When you look at, uh, obviously, there's a certain individual that used to be a client of yours. He doesn't have a match at WrestleMania, according to many. I think there's somebody who could make something happen for him and get him a big match if something were to revive, a group would revive. Uh, I've, I've made a number of overtures to Bobby Lashley. And I've asked him on Monday Night Raw to join forces again. And while he's acknowledged that we no longer have any hostility, he's just made it clear that he wants to do his own thing. And I respect the man, so I have to let him have that. But him doing his own thing hasn't worked out very well for him. No. And as I said, he was the WWE Universal two Champion. Time two time WWE Champion. Yeah. And now he doesn't even have a match at WrestleMania. You know what's missing? MVP. Because Omas has a match at WrestleMania. He does. So I've, I've said many times today, Bobby, you have my number. Let's talk some business. Let me ask you last question. Uh, the 305, they're in the final four, Miami. Yes. How excited. Oh, that brought a smile to your face. How excited are you for that? Well, I, I love it because I'm from Miami. I love the U. I grew up on the University of Miami in college sports. And our football program is what defined the University of Miami. And because of lots of you know poor decisions and missteps, our program suffered. The, the football program suffered. But Miami was never known as a basketball school. They always kept a pretty good team. You know, back in the days of the Big East, they were all right. But now to, to be able to make it to the Final Four and to have the University of Miami or, you know, have an opportunity to, to play the, the national championship, it's pretty huge. So I'll be rooting them on. I'm excited. Do you think they'll be champions on Monday? Say again? Do you think they'll be champions come Monday? Uh, I certainly hope so. I, I believe they can do it. So. You hear to hear from Mr. MVP. Thank you so much for joining us. You're very welcome. The pleasure was all yours. I know. I know. Now my life goes back to sucking. Yeah, pretty much. Sorry. <laughs>